My friends, this is a Healy. It's got a wheel in it, and it's mainly used by people that look like this. Now this is a running shoe, and it's mainly used to help people who look like this tackle one of the hardest challenges on the planet, the marathon. Now since marathons were invented, 149 million people worldwide have run one in these. But nobody's ever done one in these. Until now, my friends, I am going to be the first person in existence to run a marathon in Healy's. No, you're not. This is my editor, Mikey. He is barely my assholes. If I go to Vietnam, he must go to Vietnam. If I do a TED Talk, he must do a TED Talk. If I run a marathon in Healy's... 100% I could do it quicker than you. There's no way you're, you're sticking through 26 miles. There's no way. Have Wait, you ever worn Healy's? No. I don't need to wear he I just it's it's a it's a man. You marathon. couldn't do it faster than me. I could do it faster. What do you mean? No. There's no way. No, 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 no. All right. If you're so confident, we'll put a bet on. Double your wages for a month. If you lose, you get nothing. I will take that every day of the week. Shake my hands. All right. With this much at stake, we needed to set some rules. <laughs> Facts. Uh, so wear the shoes at all times. Wear the shoes at all times. Wheels must remain in the shoes. You can't receive physical assistance from anybody but yourself. All right, my friends, one thing we didn't specify there is which marathon we'll have to do. So I've had a bit of an idea to try and gain a competitive advantage. And for my marathon, I'm heading to Vegas. My marathon strategy is very simple. Stay out of the sun. So I'm off to Freiburg in Germany. And then we'll go to the marathon expo. It's the same thing. You have to get a bus from the strip to the start, which is at the top of the mountain. How comes yours is downhill? <laughs> You're starting at the top of a mountain? Are you fucking kidding me? This is a joke! Not just downhill, um, the world's most downhill marathon. Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, my friends, it's 3am and we're about to get taken to the start line. Oh, fancy, fancy! <laughs> Whoa, that ought to get you down the mountain. I'm in Freiburg, Germany, ready for my marathon today. So you're gonna run with us? Or? Yeah. Well, don't do it with, the, with the, those roller blades. But, but well, wasn't it not 10 years ago, Trent? I have special shoes. I've got wheels on my feet. So that's, <laughs> that's, I've got special shoes on. Now, we were both quite upbeat about our chances until I realized I'd overlooked something quite important about starting a marathon on top of a mountain. What's it outside? Minus five. Yeah, it's minus five. Why is it minus five? It's 4 a.m. in the fucking morning. Come to Vegas. Oh, yeah. T-shirt, fucking shorts. Do you think I could keep up with you in these? Oh, man. <laughs> that is a ballsy. Keep your eyes out. There's still black ice on those roads. Together, follow the flag! Oh, I, hate the, oh, I, hate the, I hate the country. <laughs> nice. Let's go! Now, my route for the marathon looks like this, right? We start at the top of this big hill, we go all the way down pretty much in a straight line. Mikey's, on the other hand, is a little bit different. His task today is to complete two laps. I am of this rather uninspiring looking German town. My first healing of the race, I'm feeling good. Feeling loose, feeling lean. I can't feel my feet. Premier Pro can't save you now, fella. French press is no good. Oh, yeah. You guys should have thought of this. 7,000 feet. Is that <laughs> like... Oh, chippy. <laughs> oh, brother, that is good. You are finished, you big, pale moron ginger. Wait, you're an ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, bud. I think you might fall, though. Don't fall. What did you say you think you might fall? You said don't fall. Ah, oh, fuck off, you two. Literally, someone the other day was like, why don't you just wear Sheely's? That's awesome. Your cows are gonna burn like shit. Yeah, nice to meet you two. Despite being surrounded by Americans, it was beginning to look like I'd made the right choice. The elevation change was making life easy, and we were gliding down the mountain. Can you a pair of those shoes at like the 24 or something? It was looking good for Team William until we had our first mishap. Oh, oh shit, you good? You good? Ah, Got plasters if you need them. There you go. The difference is, right, if we're losing, he can't order Deliveroo for the sixth time in a day. Whereas if I lose, I can't eat for a month. Nice. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh yeah. 
This is what Will's going to be doing the whole race. As soon as I get there, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll find you. You'll take your phone. Um, and what we're going to say, mile 10 we meet. That's goodbye. Right. Look after yourself. Okay, my friends, and then it was just us. We are dropped out with injuries and we're a little behind pace because of it. But alas, what can you do? <laughs> just giggle at me and then overtake. <laughs> I'm such a joke. <laughs> oh, sorry, I can't understand German. I think you called me stupid. Oh, yes. Let gravity do the work. What I'm really worried is that the shoes aren't going to make it all the way. Because I'll finish, but I don't know if the shoes will. <laughs> oh, God, is it actually... <laughs> Downhill, really good. Everything else, it's terrible. Okay, it's like weighted high heels. It's not your first marathon, is it? It is. Okay, hello my friends. Update, it's fucking lonely. I'm just in the arse end of nowhere. No sign of the sea in the distance. So the issue at the minute is all the weights on my front toes. And I got a bunch of fucking, well, I don't know if I got blisters. I think I'm just thinking I've got blisters. I just gotta pray Mikey's struggling. Ah, oh, this is Healy Road. That must have been a good shot. <laughs> the natural enemy of the Healy, a slight incline. <laughs> oh, my friends, this is quite tough. But uh, do you know what makes my life a lot easier? Revolut. What's Revolut? You, the, uh, the uneducated viewer says, it's a financial super app used by over 25 million worldwide. It's super easy and free to download, as you can see here by this pale ginger Neanderthal doing it while he runs a marathon. Wow. So easy! Revolut allows you to save as you spend. Get up to 30% off your favourite brands like Adidas, Domino's and Nike. Revolut saved us some wonga on our cameraman Yarn's shoes, as well as on our travel getting here with no fees and uh, with like the conversion at the real exchange rate. So what are you waiting for? Revolut is free and super easy to use. Download it now. And if you use my link and spend 20 quid, Revolut will give you 20 quid. And that was your doing. <laughs> it's not, trust me. I've got a bet with my friend. All oh, right. We're both racing in these. But did you pay for it? No. Can you continue like this forever? No. Do you save energy? No. It's so much worse. <laughs> I really don't know how Will's going to keep these shoes on the whole time. Because my feet are bleeding. <sighs> So I feel all right, to be fair. I feel like I could be going quicker in running shoes. Just if I go quicker, the pain gets a lot worse. So I feel fitness-wise, I feel okay. Toes-wise, and I am a toe man, not so good. Please subscribe, by the way. Now, as we approached halfway, we were genuinely neck and neck. However, Mikey was about to call it a secret weapon, his parents. So box, 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 box. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Big fucking pizza. Big fucking burger. Big fucking titties. Fucking cobbled streets. This is the worst video we've ever done. By a mile. Well, by 26 miles, actually. <laughs> is that it? That's the halfway. Oh my god. Okay, you lot. Now, long term viewers of this channel will know that last time we went abroad, this man learned the language. Okay, is that all? Well, this time he decided he wasn't wasting his time on German. And with the entry to the second half of his marathon coming up, it was about to prove to be a mistake. Yeah, I'm doing the marathon. Where do I go? Yeah. Do I keep going? Yeah, you keep uh, oh, I don't know where to go. I am totally lost. I'm struggling. I was fine fitness-wise. I'm I don't know if I'm fine fitness-wise anymore. But at last we move on. Because my friends, it's all in your head. It'll be over soon. These times will pass. And you will have a big, a big fat burger soon. And a fucking pint. Where do I continue the marathon? Yeah, I have no so idea. You have to only run the half. Probably. Yeah, I've only run the half, yeah. No, you're on the wrong way. Okay. How do I get back on the running track? I don't know. Yeah, he wants to do the second. Yeah. <laughs> so what's the name probably? I will talk to you the stuff at the... Uh, at the... You, you, ran, you ran through That's the finish line. Go front and to the left. Go back to the bridge. It's this way. It's it's it is this way. Oh, this is a disaster. I would say this is the hardest thing I've ever done. This is fucking knackering. The good thing is we can see Vegas in the distance. Yes. I think I am now literally the last person doing this marathon. Everyone's doing their daily shopping again. I can't believe what might make me lose to Will Lenny is my fucking stupidity. I have hit a fucking wall. Everything is given out, but I've just got to keep going and I've just got to hope it's happened to him too. Ah! 
<laughs> Alright, my friends, what we were struggling with so badly here was the toes. You see, with the wheel on the back of the shoe, with every step of the way, all of your weight lapped here. I personally decided it would be a good idea to buy some new leather light up heelys the day before my marathon and use those instead of the ones I had trained in. Uh, well, because of this, the blisters in my feet had gotten so bad, I was starting to bleed through the shoe. Oh, that looks good. Um, chicken. Hello, my friends. What I was saying about it's all mental earlier in the video. Physical's gone too. Basically, I am. I'm happy to lose. <laughs> Do you want me to carry you a little way? No, you can't carry me. That's against the rules. We go the route, not taking the shoes off, and we're finishing the race. Welcome to the race. <laughs> This is a stupid, stupid fucking... I, honestly, I'd pay him three months' wages just not to be here anymore. Look at this! It's just the middle of fucking arse end of nowhere. I was talking to some bloke, and he was saying, Oh, last September I ran 100 miles. I've done 100 miles. Oh. You did 100 miles? Why? Well, he's like, oh, it took us 36 hours. Well done, you could have drove it in three. Lads, I think that large orange man is gaining on us. Oh man, but why don't you start by watch for me? Absolutely, yeah. How's he beating us, man? How's he? Oh, look how good this looks on camera. Look at this. Oh, what a beautiful, picturesque, beautiful. Oh, that's, that's not funny. Uh, we have now been followed by some cars, and I think they're closing the marathon. Got it. About two and a half miles left. It's okay, we're allowed to be in the bike lane. I've got two wheels. I'm basically a bike. Oh, fuck off. Even if I lose, at least I've got a dad who cares about me. <laughs> me legs shaking. You look behind you. Oh, fuck off. Shoes still on, baby. Shoes still on. Oh my god, I recognise this bit. We're so close. This is it. This is it. This is it. <laughs> Aha, my friends, the finish line. What a joy. Yes! Yes! Oh. Oh. I'm proud of you, mate. This is where the finish line was, and here I am now. Beat that, Will Lenny. Beat that. Oh, fucking shut up, man. Fucking Clapton. Get a grip. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What a load of shit. This is. Thanks. Mikey also said, uh, the only thing that will make him feel better about having to eat rice and beans for the entirety of next month would be if you subscribe to the channel right now. Thank you.